Josh's new 2008 YZ, YZF 450. Taking off the red ink decals. Oh, son of a. <laughs> this is guaranteed 13 inch horsepower right here. <laughs> yeah, we're about to take this one off and then rub it down with alcohol. Kind of, we kind of had a little trouble figuring out where they go because uh. You know, I've never done any quad type deals, and uh... No, we have four brain cells. Yeah, only four brain cells, so yeah, we, we really didn't know what was going on. But yeah, just to give you a little rundown of the bike, I mean, quad, since we really have it. Man, I'm keep saying, okay, I'm gonna just call it a bike. But um, anyway, about the bike, um, it has Alba Pro Elite, Nerf bars, obviously both sides. Oh, that's where that freaking um, was coming from. What? Oh yeah, shoot. And then an Alba, what's it called? I don't know, holds the bars down, you know, you know what I'm talking about. Um, Pro Taper bars, or tape hangers, I think that's what they call them. Um, I don't know what brand these are, but they're, they're obviously hand guards. Um, yeah, knuckle busters. But um, what else? I think, I don't know if these are the elbows or something else, but oh yeah, I'm pretty sure they're elbows. Um, yeah. Has an outerwear pre-filter with a brand new air filter in it. Um, it looks like brand new or, yeah, pretty much brand new tires, but um, Maybe like 5% of these on them or 10%, something like that. But they're pretty much brand new on them. That's sweet. Um, it has an aftermarket exhaust, which is a BMC full exhaust, I guess. Um, and, and we got the stock exhaust. Yeah, and we got the stock also with a, with a stock uh, light too, if we ever want to put the put a different one of these. But this is aftermarket. I really don't know what it is, but it looks good. I actually like it a lot. And uh, the same color red. Let's get to the back. <laughs> yeah, and it's the same color red, so it looks sweet. Um, what else? I mean, that's the only really aftermarket stuff done to it. I mean, it's not much, but it's a sweet bike. I, I really wouldn't want a bike with a ton of crap either, because that's probably the things they're racing and stuff. But, um, oh yeah, I almost forgot. A Tusk um, case protector right here, or uh, yeah, case saver, whatever. 
for if the chain flies off. Um, yeah, and I think there's one more, something else. I was after Marquette. I forget what it was, though. So. Oh, yeah. It's Pro Elite Little Cover right here. I saw it on the front. But yeah. It looks good. It looks good. But yeah, we should be sitting around the block. Freaking first to third popping up. Man, these things are scary. I don't know how anybody freaking races quads. Or like, if you ever rode a, rode a, geez, I can't even speak. If you ever rode a quad on the road, like, if it comes up and you come down in the wheels, it's the like front wheels. a wheel, little bit crooked. Like, yeah, you like go straight that way, man. It's freaking scary as crap. Okay. I feel bad for those like ATL bike riders that like, are, are going through, yeah, around? yeah, ripping around on the road on these, man, those dudes. I don't know how to fit on the quad without them balls. I do, <laughs> yeah, right. Dude, I do, like, dirt bikes are so much safer, I feel like. Plus, these one of these roll on you, budged. But yeah. <laughs> and then, I don't know what tires these are. Is it ambush? I guess they're, yeah, ambush tires. I mean, they look good. But, um, yeah, we're trying to figure out these, uh, whatever decals, so we're throwing them on right now. Um, I think that about looks super good because the bike kind of just looks really bare right now But once those are on it matches everything. Oh my gosh But yeah, we're about to get to that about this. Should this I go, the moment. Should I go um, bottom up? Dude, honestly, I try to line up as well as I could right here. Like this and then go straight yeah. down yeah. But if I were you, just make sure whenever you put it on you like go like this because whenever I'm on the YZ decals I kind of like, I don't know, it's a certain way This actually looks really nice on camera. Honestly, it looks slick better on camera than it does in person. <laughs> oh, that's smart. That's a smart one. This one is on with barely any air holes. We got one yeah. kind of big one right there, but honestly, I don't think anybody's ever done this and hasn't like has ever done it perfectly, so we don't care. But yeah, first one on, we're gonna do the rest. It's kind of hard to keep the camera on us. Sorry guys while we're doing it because it kind of takes two people because you don't want it to be all screwed up. So yeah, we're just gonna kind of take our time with it and show you the after results. I'm sure you guys know what we're doing. So yeah, so we're about halfway through. Got these back ones on, these little front ones on the top. Uh, gas tank on and uh, front one. So once we put these on the side and all these other ones, she's gonna be looking really good. Did you ever make a video about your truck? <laughs> no. Oh yeah, I got a truck. A black six oh. Yeah. Um, this is more important right now. <laughs> so we're about to put these big ones on right now. Josh about to put it on. We'll get so it. we got that side on. We're working on the bike and now it's hailing outside. Jeez, I'm crape. I haven't seen hail in forever. Well, I hailed a little bit, now it's back to rain. Might be hailing still a little bit, but I don't know. But yeah. Um, we have, I think, a couple more little pieces left. And this gets weird. I honestly think like, the guy forget, forget, forgot to give us one box. Yeah, 
because these seem really bare to be a part of this kit, but I don't know, whatever. Looks a lot better than it was anyway, so we're gonna finish up and show you the final product. So we finally finished it up. Um, what happened was, I think this guy forgot to give us, I mean, Jesus, forgot to give us a box of different, uh, maybe the rest of the decals, because we're like 99, we looked at other decals on uh, other decal packs and they always come with this, like a big piece for this and a big piece for that. And also maybe, I'm um, pretty sure they go, one goes right here and one goes right here, cause and right there too. Cause I'm pretty sure on all decal kits, it's supposed to cover pretty much like 90% of the plastics. And um, this one does about maybe 70%. Yeah, so um, I don't know. I think it still looks great like this. Honestly, it looks a lot better than just that thing on the side. It looks like, looks really, really good, but I think it just like did a little touch better with if he gave us the rest of the other box, but you know, what are you gonna do? I mean, I think it looks good regardless because there's still gray on this, so no matter what, I mean, I think it looks good. But um, yeah, that's the final product. And um, yeah, once again, only thing I said, it's a 2008, I did say it. Well, yeah, 2008 YZF 450 and then loose racing cover. But yeah, it's nice. Um, that's just crap. We're just gonna mess around a little bit more, maybe uh, tighten a couple of bolts, because I think there's one loose one on it, just a little bit loose right there. Just put a washer on that and it should be fine, but whatever. Yeah, we're just gonna keep tinkering with it a little bit. Obviously, we're not gonna ride it, but um, yeah, it's a new bike.